Aaron, uh, my question is a little different. I have an aunt and uncle who are huge Obama fans and frankly talk about how he's done everything he promised. Now it's just the Republicans blocking everything. I usually say I'll nothing. I'll take it. I'll take but what it. Do you think, what do you think I could say? Uh, well, actually, you know what? I'm, I'm happy to hear that. I would, that would a dream to be with relatives who say something like that. I can't in, in, in any way conceive of anyone I'm related to besides Patrick. Saying and his wife Dina Marin. Pat Garofalo. Yes. Pat Garofalo, my nephew, just married Mark Marin's cousin, Dina Ooh, Marin. God. Mark that Marin of just... a, I don't know if you've heard it's a podcast called WTF. Not Sam. heard of it. No. You've not heard of that? Nope. It's really popular. I not so sure. He also has a television Oh, is that pro- Adam Carolla? No, 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 no. It's Mark <laughs> Marin. He also has a television program. On IFC. Oh my God! I know who you're talking about. Mark uh, Maron. No, he was a co- comedian from Boston. He is a comedian and an actor. And he does very... kickboxing no, 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 and no, no, no. transcendental, no, 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 transcendental no, no, no. meditation of, and uh, pot smoking. Whoever that Joe is. Joe Rogan. Joe Rogan. Right. No, this is Mark Maron. WTF with Joe Rogan. No, no, no it's WTF <laughs> with Mark Maron. Who? Okay. Who? Uh, my nephew just married his cousin. But Ooh. anyway, I digress. Andy Kimber. It would be amazing. To have a relative say that phrase, Obama's done everything. It's just the Republicans. <laughs> but I will say that that part of that is true. The Republicans have blocked. They've made it their to block every, 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 everything. Yes, but, but that Obama's cuts both been ways. too willing. That also to cuts both ways. Uh, the, uh, the 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 Republicans have also blocked the grand bargain and have probably kept uh, the uh, this Democratic president from from cutting uh, Social Security. So I mean, it cuts both ways. But, uh, it doesn't cut both ways. It's not really that that it cuts both ways. There might be a little bit of a jab one way, but the Republicans no, but that have stood in the way of uh, to such a philosophy. They've elevated it to a philosophy. They they what they have done in terms of obstruction has been beyond has has been beyond the norms that have been established but, by uh, our government. Yet yeah, throughout the norms, I mean, again, it's like this experiment. What can we do? Right. How ridiculous can we be? And how can we turn it around on Meet the Press that it's him doing it? And you just say it, like Eric Cantor, you just say it flat out that it's, or Mitch McConnell, they just, and Bonaire. Well, what's worth, that it, what's worse is you get someone way. like Chuck Todd who says like, oh yeah, yeah, I can see your point. No, I know. See, uh, yeah, it's that. But I would say to this person, um, Alexander, Alexandra, I would say you're so lucky. That's right. I can't imagine. It must be heaven to have parents who say that. Uh, and God bless you, child. Let's go to... <laughs> Although I, I'm an atheist, I just felt like saying it. I was so moved. Okay.